intro. Subpar graphics, third time in a row. This show needed another hiatus to finish these. I've networked all my bee bots. Whenever they spot Team Sonic, the bees will automatically attack. If only you thought of it before. I've got some retreating to do. The fun kind, not the I've just been defeated kind. Or you could say, I've got suffocationing to do. Hey gang, got a bee bot situation out here. Take them all out yourself. In the main series now, you're usually the only useful character. Also, laser stings are busted. Drink! Always an ire with you. Better do a test run, just to be safe. Not on yourself! And... Stray Bee Bot. This parody of The Fly are not on, but two weeks before Halloween. You wanted Charmy? Here he is, same voice actress and everything. Also, insert Bee Movie joke here. Sonic Lost World Star Roboticization. And this doesn't even include B. I was hoping no one would notice. No offense, but that alternate voice sounds like Colleen made it up on the spot. Tails' inventions tend to be a little buggy. Seriously? <laughs> wow! Guess you won't need an oven anymore. Join us. Join us. They're not even trying to avoid the join us, join us cliche. Also, the Beebots don't have a hype to speak of, unless they made Eggman's lair. And this is another plot repeat. But I appreciate how this transition's more natural than in Mech Suits Me. Tails meshes the workbench without touching it. But Knuckles just... No! Bad echidna! Don't eat the throw up! A solar eclipse! Everybody is built in eclipse glasses. It is sick. You're not supposed to look directly into a solar eclipse. Charlie and a laugh without making noise. I'm gonna be stuck like this forever. But look! Opportunity on the news. Victims awaiting their snowy doom include Tommy Thunder and some other nobodies who probably have families or whatever. Or whatever? You're fired! Sonic has no mess. These new B-Wings allow me to fly much more precisely than my tails ever did. Too bad it'll all be over by the end of the day. He's not one of us. You can't judge him until you walked a mile in his shoes. Chumley in a dangerous place. I'm surprised the kid lasted this long. Oh! Gather! Someone swoops in and takes control of your robots and you do nothing? Like when the lightning bolts did it? Now let's try a test run on an inanimate object. What Tails should have done? It's multi-tails all over again! Now bring in Tails so I can get back in time for the villain talent show. But you've only tested it once. Maybe you should do it with a non-food item. There's a robot in the village. I just thought of something. Tails didn't mention anything about flowers or nectar. This idea is contrived. Just a regular old sunflower over here. Also, sunflowers don't talk. You won't get away this time, you flightless ficus! You won't get away this time, cliche. I'm not a ficus, I'm a sunflower! What kind of bee are you? <laughs> you tell him, Sonic Flower. You know, normally I prefer to resolve conflict with words. No, you don't. Sorry we have to do this, Tails. No decency for that line. Sonic just can't stand spin dashing in his costume. Suddenly I see his communicator. What happened? Amnesia, again. Why are you dressed like a daffodil? Tails isn't a botanist, but why can't he identify basic flowers? Because it's funny. And I think we all learned a valuable lesson today. And what lesson was that? Uh, I don't know, don't turn into a bee or something? How about be careful with your inventions? That should be a lesson every time! Wait a sec. You're not supposed to look directly into a solar eclipse.